If you aren't going to be using your Steam Deck for a few weeks, to a few months, or even longer, then it's advised to put the device into storage mode. This is also recommended to use storage mode if you plan on opening up the device for repairs or hardware replacements. Storage mode on the Steam Deck makes it so that the device does not respond to any button presses which make it a great option for those times that you plan on shipping the Steam Deck as well. For optimal battery health, try to get the battery level to around 50 to 60% before entering storage mode. Valve even gives a warning to not do this on your Steam Deck if the battery is at 80% or higher, since it isn't good for the battery, nor is it safe. So today, I'll be showing you how to enter storage mode on your Steam Deck, as well as showing you how to reboot out of it and back into Steam OS. To begin, we first need to boot the device into BIOS mode, which basically requires you to press and hold the volume up button while the device is booting up. Now, if you need a step-by-step -step guide on how to access BIOS mode on the Steam Deck, I'll be sure to include a link to a dedicated guide I've already done that shows you everything you need to know. Once your Steam Deck is at this BIOS menu here, let's now access the Setup Utility in the bottom right corner. Then from here, we're going to scroll down and select the power menu. And right up here at the top, you should see battery storage mode. After selecting this mode, we're going to choose yes to confirm. And you should see the Steam Deck proceed to shut down. When the device turns off, your Steam Deck will have entered storage mode which means it will not respond to any hardware buttons at all. It doesn't matter if you're pressing the power button or any of the other buttons. So you can see why this is ideal for those times when you need to ship out the hardware. That way, the Steam Deck will not accidentally turn on and then overheat while it's packaged up. Since the Steam Deck does not respond to any hardware button presses, Valve has created a special way of exiting storage mode. And all you have to do is plug it in to a charger. And that will begin the boot up process. You'll hear that jingle happen. You'll see the Steam Deck logo. And it will begin to boot up. This does not have to be the official charger either, just a regular USB-C cable that is plugged into a wall charger or a PC. Something that's basically powerful enough to give it a charge. As the Steam Deck leaves storage mode, you'll be taken right back into SteamOS, just like a regular boot process. This is only required after you have manually entered storage mode. So as long as you're putting the device to sleep by pressing the power button, or even shutting it down through the menu here, you won't need a charger to wake it up in that way. This process is only required when it is in storage mode. Now, if you have any questions, about this method or about the Steam Deck in general, then please do not hesitate to leave a comment down below. And remember, please like this video while also subscribing to the channel for more Steam Deck tips like this.